Hi and welcome to my channel. If you're new here, please subscribe if you want to join in in the fun. Um, I will be uploading videos every week. Um, videos on motherhood, lifestyle, beauty, bargain, a bit of everything really. So yeah, if you're into all that, then please subscribe. This is my first video. So yeah, take it easy on me, okay? You can't be the Fanta, can you? So yeah, today I thought we'd do a pre-mark testing makeup video. Um, I'm going to be honest with you, a lot of the stuff that I was looking for, they didn't have. So I had to improvise and rummage through my makeup bag for this to be like um, a proper, you know, pre mac testing video. I wanted a full face of pre mac products. So I managed to do that with going through my makeup bag. I've done well. The only thing I haven't got is a setting powder. But we're going to roll with it anyway. So... To start off, I bought these little booty blenders. Um, and girls, if you are like me and you hate the blenders that when you run into warm water and they don't grow, these are growers. You'll be pleased to know. Um, yeah, so we start off with a primer. Now, this... I ha already had in my makeup bag. It's Prep and Perfect Hydrate Enrich Skin Primer containing vitamin B3 and vitamin E. Not sure if they still have it. They might, but yeah, let's give it a go. Um, I can't. I can't remember how much it was like that, but I think it was about two pound maybe so if we just rub that in it's going to be hydrating and I do oh I forgot the headband yeah this little headband here was two pound which I thought was quite cute just to whack on the makeup Now I've primed on my face. I bought the foundation in the double coverage matte foundation. Now this is meant to be the dupe of the Estee Lauder. I can never say that right. I sound so bad when I say that. Estee Lauder. Estee Lauder. It's my accent, okay? Um, in the shade, shade you nude. So yeah, I've heard good things about this. It's meant to be long wearing, matte finish, oil free, which is good because I do tend to have oily skin. Let's give that a go. <gasps> These are nice booty blenders. These are nice booty blenders. Now I am in no way makeup artist and I am not going to pretend to be I'm just in it you know for the fun I'm just gonna have a bit of fun testing the makeup out and yeah just to see being a mum of two boys you know I don't like to spend a lot of money on makeup um because I don't wear makeup every day I kind of just wear it for special occasions or Midweek, if I've got a, an appointment, you know, I'll wear it, I'll wear it then. So, you know, because sometimes, God, I'm so pale and I look ill <laughs> if I haven't kept up with the, the fake tan. So, you know, just something to just chuck on your face. But it doesn't cost the earth. 
I'm all down for, you know? So, yeah. Well, it's going on nicely. And you know, I think it's SPF 15, is it? Yeah, SPF 15. And I do like a good SPF in my foundation. But yeah, it seems to be blending, uh, going on nice. We cannot forget the neck, can we? The only thing I'd say about this um, blender is I like a softer, like softer, it is quite like, you know, it's a bit hard. The way I'm talking about these blenders today, gosh. Down the neck. Well, necks, I should say. I've grown a bit of a... Anyone else during lockdown, you know? Added some chins to the family. Let me know in the comments below. Hopefully it's not just me. <laughs> okay. I think we're good. I'm happy with that. I don't like to um, put too much on. Because I find it sits in your wrinkles. When you get to 30... Okay, you got you gotta look out for these things. So yeah, I was like like a light to medium kind of coverage. So yeah, right. Next I'm gonna go in with the concealer. Um again they didn't have um concealer when I locked in my store in Trostra um so luckily I had already had some in my bag and this is the my perfect color liquid foundation in a medium coverage and it's in the shade porcelain so let's um hope now, I don't know about you, but I really struggle to find um, a concealer that doesn't sit in my crow's feet, as they call them, um, and just make me look older, like emphasises then your wrinkles. So if you if you found one, you know you're around thirty plus, and you found one that you know that doesn't kind of sink into your lines, then please let me know because I'm forever. I've heard um Maybelline. Oh, the one with the funny nose at the top. Is it Age Razor? I feel that's meant to be really good. I haven't gone around to trying that one yet, though. Okay, so that's brightened up. Run dry a bit. Oh, see. <gasps> okay. Yeah, see, so I haven't got a setting powder to kind of set the end dry. So we're gonna have to just wing it today and go without. I also bought a hang on a minute. Just remembered something. Like another liquid concealer. Exactly like the other one. But darker. In the shade Kimball, yeah, I'm sure that says Kimball. Kimball, so I'm just gonna use a bit of this um, for here. It is warm. Um, I, t I usually use. 
know, more, a cooler tone to contour. But we're limited, guys. So we're just going to... We're just going to go with it. And see what we've got. Like I said. Oh my god. This is just a bit of fun. You know? Yeah, I watched a video on um is it how to how to give your nose a nose job. <laughs> so uh yeah, I've got quite a conk. Um and we're gonna Try and make her skinnier, you know? I don't know if you've uh, noticed, but I am all about a natural look. I don't, I know one, I just find it, make, it does nothing for me, you know? So yeah, I am all about the natural look. If anything, it ages me if I put too much on. I end up looking, thinking 40, not 30. <laughs> um, oh yeah, again, yeah, the lines. I'm trying to, you know, lose a chin or two. In case you're wondering. Oh God. See, as you can tell, I am no pro. Okay, dab, 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 dab. Okay. Right, this brush is a pre-mac brush I bought not that long ago and it's a blending brush and I'm just going to use that to blend this in a bit. So what do you think? Has it made my nose a tad skinnier? Has she lost a few pounds? Let me know what you think. Okay. Yeah, and I think this brush is like 90p or a pound. Something along the lines. And a nice rose gold as well, They're quite pretty. Um, okay, so next we're gonna go in with this bronze glow, which is a pound matte bronzing powder. I like the color of this, look quite nice. So we'll give it a whirl, and I'm gonna use again another pre mac brush, powder brush. Um, I already had this in my bag, and um, really soft, and yeah. So let's give it a go. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. Katrin, you think you went a bit in a bit too much there? Okay. So it's very pig <laughs> it's very pigmented. So maybe just just tap, tap. Oh my gosh. Okay, okay. We're gonna save this, okay? <laughs> we are gonna save this. There's me. Oh yeah, I love the natural look. No, we're gonna we're gonna save it, okay? We're gonna get the old foundation sponge now. And it's gonna be okay. Everything's gonna be fine. <laughs> well I was not expecting it to come out like that. Woo! Too bad, is it? We're bronzed. We're bronzed. I think we can get away with that. Okay. What else did I buy? Okay. So we'll go for the eyes next. Um, I went for the neon eyeshadow palette. This is five pound. And look at the colours. 
don't know what what like i'm going for you so you'll have to bear with me literally just winging it today but these are the colors you'd never say it's autumn do you? I'm, I'm still hanging on okay let's just hang on to some of that little bit longer i love the colors of these so okay let's should have taken this off beforehand really but Gosh, right, we're good. So I'm gonna start off with, I'm gonna get my blending brush and I'm going to, I'm gonna use a bit of the uh, bronze and powders like um, transition shade. I tend to do that a lot. Use my bronzer. Although, okay, it's quite strong. I quite like this bronzer, you know. It's really nice. Really like it. For a pound as well, like, mad. A madness. Okay. Shall we be bold? Shall we be brave? What do you reckon? Be brave, Catherine. Be brave. Okay. Okay. I'm going to go for this colour here. Be brave, she says. Hang on. And I'm going to... Okay. Oh, that's nice, actually. Subtle, but nice. Okay, and then I'm gonna go in with this one, this shade. Oh, God, that's quite orange. God, I'm gonna have some crazy eyes on the go now in a minute. Why not? It's a neon palette, you know? Just go for it. Okay. All right, I'll go, I'll go for the middle. <laughs> hey, at least it'll match, it'll match my headband, you know? Oh, wow, okay. I did not think it'd be that pigmented. Nice. Oh, that is a cute pink. I love it. God, I did not need to, literally, look. Tapped it, and that's the colour. I love it. I love it. <laughs> okay. I'm just going to run that underneath a little bit. <clears throat> and then I'm going to go in a bit with this just at the outer corner oh <laughs> i keep dabbing too hard and these colors are a bit you know they don't mess about you know they don't know mess about <laughs> okay The same with this eye. Oh gosh, okay. Now we're uh, looking a bit cray cray. It's gonna look good, okay? Have, have faith, have faith. And then I, with my finger, I'm gonna break the rules and just blend that a little bit in. Pretty, and I might put a bit of that in the in the corner. I 
I'm impressed though with the pigmentation of these. It's insane. Literally insane. So pretty. Okay. I'm going to leave my eyes like that for now. <laughs> and uh, we may come back. <gasps> Look at that yellow. <coughs> okay, put it down, Captain, put it down. Um, I also bought... I bought this mascara, which is £3. It's the false... The, the false... False Lash Queen. I haven't tried this before, so I'm excited to see. And I also got the Sosu Eyelashes um, Perry. Quite naturally feathery, pretty. Good band, easy application. And I also bought the Duo Glue, Eyelash Glue. So let's get it. Um, a lot of girls I see, they do the mascara first and then they whack the lashes on. I just can't do it that way. Let's go. Can you see the concentration on my face? Are you gonna come out? Ooh, what? This is black? Okay. Black eyelash glue. Well, why haven't they thought of that a long time ago? The one I used to buy used to be white. And that was duo, I think. Oh gosh. But yeah, black. Perfect. Such a good idea. As we get all excited over. Oh God. <gasps> okay, let's, let's, let's give it a go. Oh my God. Oh, we're hanging on for dear life here. Yeah. Now maybe a small mirror would be best. Let's try again. Take two. Okay. Oh. Oh no. If anyone knows a secret to doing these so well let me know you know is there a secret that i don't know about right so i'm just putting glue on the other lash You know, I would love to know how some people just literally, and they're on. Okay. Eyelashes are finally on. So we'll give them a minute. While they're having a minute, I'm going to do the eyebrows. Um, I've got a brow pomade. Um, this was £2.50 and the brush i think that was like 90p and as you can see i've already used this so this again i already had and just gonna
Kai. That will do. Now for the other. Eyebrows are done and um, now I'm gonna go in with this mascara I'm quite excited Let's see how this goes so the end looks like this okay so well nice Especially, you know, you can see with my bottom ones, it's proper, making them really nice and long. I am a fan of this. Okay, now for the other. I like. Oh, pretty. Okay, um, so I bought this blusher in the shade Carnival and that was pound. It says high pigment, so I best be careful with this one. God, we are really pinking it out today, like a Barbie girl. Oh, nice. <laughs> Should we just pretend we're going to a Barbie party? <laughs> Come on, Barbie. Okay. That's nice, that is really like that nice and pretty okay um for lips i got this lip kit um and it's the nude edit £3.50 which is not bad because you get two little matte let's see two little matte lipsticks and a lip liner so bad then really cute really cute okay okay so the lip liner is lovely um nice and creamy happy with that okay what color shall i go for i think i've literally done this look around the headband i'm not gonna lie but which shade you reckon do I go in with that or do I... <gasps> oh. Why not? Let's just do the whole pink phase. Hmm. Okay. Oh, wow. <laughs> Oh wow. What if I look? Okay. Um oh. 
confined satin spray either. So I'm using my own this I bought is Primark Glow. It's got some sparkles. I don't know if you can see it. It's got some shiny bits in. Oh, yeah. Right there. Maybe it's just shaking it a bit more. But it's got some nice, like, glittery bits. It looks really nice in the summer. Oh. Do you know what I forgot? Bit of a highlighter. Which... There weren't any, so I'm just gonna use this. That's quite nice. I'm not gonna break the rules again and lose my finger. Why not? thing I bought this um you gotta buy Prima perfume every time you go on you this is the PS love and black old who did toilet is three pound fifty um it says on the box this intense scent is a sensual blend of orange flower and dark orchids on a bed of amber and patchouli and I've already sprayed it, okay? It smells amazing. Look at the little bottle. But it smells so good, like it really does. So, you know, you got it, when you? <gasps> oh, oh, that's nice, I think I ate a bit, but. So yeah, that's gonna conclude the video and end the video. Um, so yeah. Very um pinky Barbie girl vibes, you know. The headband just give it all the inspo. So yeah, let me know what you think of the finished look. <laughs> okay, and I'm gonna have to go pick the boys up looking like this, which should be fun. Okay, and yeah, see you in the next one. Love you, bye.